Mumbo busy sweep many leaves. No magic today. Oh. <laughs> Mumbo only perform magic when it is absolutely perfect weather outside. <laughs> so if you live in Michigan, tough luck. <laughs> Mumbo never works. <laughs> Except for like one week in September. Alright, now put on this. Alright. Well, use the waiting step to get out of the Bramble Field, though. Now we have to climb the tree, which is a lot of fun. Sarcasm mode. Right. We already went to you. The leaves are kind of drying up and falling, so these are smaller than they were in summer, but we can still climb up. And we have to. I think it would be interesting. I think it would be interesting if in summer you had to climb up those leaves, and then in fall, like the first few leaves here were gone, and you had to climb down. Come on! I mean, honestly, it's amazing that these dried out leaves can actually be stood on by a bear. So, like, good job being sturdy, but, like, you are tiny. What?! I almost wonder if I should just fly down from above. But chances are I would die if I did that, so... Oh. We actually probably should not have done that. Yeah, because I still want to explore this part of the tree as well. Robin Hood, what are you doing up here? Also, I thought I've killed you like 12 times by now. Let's enter the Zubba Hive again. Nothing in here for you now, bear. We've all moved out. Except you, apparently. But there's a caterpillar and four notes in here, so you do have to climb in. I really like the look of the inside of the hive, especially over here. I mean, the camera's being a butt, but... The way it's, like, kind of transparent and golden honey is really good. Really good job on the... Uh, artists for the game. Looks really nice. Alright, I think... No, there, there's still more stuff over here. Yeah, okay. That's the bottom of the tree. Okay. Hi, dude. Yeah, there's a caterpillar over here. Ooh, Mumbo token. So my guess is there are 25 or 30 extra Mumbo tokens. Which seems like a lot, but honestly, it's pretty easy to be, like, barely scraping by for the Mumbo tokens, especially once you get to this level. Because a lot of those Mumbo tokens I've gotten, especially on Rusty Bucket Bay, are either really hard to find, or very risky to go for, so... I think they finished the floor of the fort now. They have. I don't think the jiggy's there in fall, though. I think you have to get it in summer. 
And they've actually, it looks like they've completed the bridge, too. I hate the camera here. Stop it. This is a jerky position to put a dragonfly in. Let's go up here. Hey, Nabna. Hi there, bear buddy. I need six more acorns before winter comes. Have you seen any? Oh, hey, he's actually building up a store. If he only needs six more, I guess he's gotten a decent amount himself. He won't need that caterpillar. And hey, it's an acorn. With eyes on it. Is everything sentient in this game? Mmm! Nabnut hasn't got enough acorns yet! Keep looking! Actually, I stole that from your private store, so technically... <laughs> you take two from two, you still need two, and enough to take that away from me. <laughs> I believe there's an acorn in the bottom of this lake. I would not eat an acorn that was at the bottom of a little pool, but okay. Maybe the spring water makes it taste better. I don't think that nut will mind. <laughs> I love that that's still too steep for me to get. That acorn that's hovering in the middle here, you might be like, how do I get that without dying? Well, you see how there's a bridge down there? We'll just fly to it from this side, and we will land on the bridge. Also, we're going down here. Also, there's a slope here. We walk very slowly down while Talon trotting, because this is steep enough that we will slide down. And that's the last of the acorns. Pretty simple to grab them all. Yippee! That's all the acorns I need! Here, take this! I'll see you in spring! You're welcome, Nabna. Yeah, this part. If you don't know that you can kill these guys with eggs, believe me, this whole spot is nearly impossible to do. Still not dead. There we go. Good oh, even then I still barely made it. And here's the winter switch. Yeah, this level is absolutely massive. It's cool. But wow. Uh, camera, camera. Oh, there are a whole lot of caterpillars in the fall. Or autumn, depending on which you prefer. Here. Eat them faster than that. <laughs> faster than that. <laughs> I think that maybe there are five extra caterpillars? I don't know. I don't know everything there is to know about this game. There you go, Yuri. Thank you, Bear! Yuri soon be Big Bird! Must have sleep first! In winter, he's literally Big Bird from Sesame Street. That would be funny. Oh boy. Oh yeah, and we still need to get the Jiggy on top of that plant. Oh, there are even more caterpillars than I thought. Yeah, don't 
don't think there's anything in here. Maybe there's another one up that we don't need. Doesn't look like it. Imagine how much of a pain it is to get off of the tree without knowing about that spotlight tray. Anyhow. Um, thank you, camera. I think we can actually climb the point. Yeah. These leaves are solid platforms. I was just dumb. Like, we can't grab the center. Um, what? <laughs> I do not understand the platforms in this game somehow. Times. <laughs> yeah, well, look at that. That is so bad. Case of a jump from the beehive to the plant, because I actually don't remember how to get this. Oh yeah, that's exactly what you have to do. Jump from the beehive to the plant. Okay. Also, you may have noticed we haven't gotten any hollow honeycomb pieces on this level yet. That's because both of the hollow honeycomb pieces are in winter. There we go, give me that jiggy. <laughs> if I die in winter, I may be one sad. 2D painting. Alright, that. <laughs> I can't think of anything else in Spur and Fall that we haven't done, so I think we've explored literally everything. One season to go, hopefully. And, uh, if you may have guessed, uh, some very annoying enemies will be reappearing again this time. Oh, hey, Robin Hood. You're dead. From Frostbite. You heard that laughter. It's the evil snowman! And all the fly traps are now <laughs> dead. So actually, most of the enemies in winter are just gone. Which is nice. The Bramble Field has a lot of snow on it. Let's see what Mumbo's up to. Um. Mumbo's on vacation, you hairy fool! Come back in the spring! Never mind it. Broke you open just because he called me a fool, but I'm not that sadistic. Hey man, you you keep a good eye out on Mumbo's house. Make sure nobody. <laughs> well, I don't think you really can. Make sure nobody steals stuff from him. There's a flight pad there. We'll be making use of that. Ha 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 ha. Was that 
Okay, I'm very curious now. Because if if I am <laughs> if I'm left with 24 Momo tokens, I might literally just make a trip to Bubble Boop Swamp to pick up the one I know I missed. Because unless I'm missing, I think I've got every other Momo token in the game. Granted, I haven't gone up the tree at all yet, so there could be even more. Okay, no, nope. I'm guessing there are 30 extra Momo tokens. That's actually very impressive. Well, a lot of them are on this course. Alright, let's find that flight pad. They got some evil snowmen. I bounced off him and then went up too high. What's going on here? Hey, is there a thing I can do for you, man? Oh, look, it's an Ikimbokum. Ikimbokum. Yeah, I bet, I bet you almost any man that there's 30 extra Mumbo tokens. Maybe, maybe I'll, maybe I'll collect them all in a bonus video or something. flight pad on that platform. I think the flight pad, flat pad is there in every season, but I think the flight trap is blocking it most of the time. Um. Oh, you. And there's the witch switch. I couldn't remember which season it was in. It's in winter. Gotta fly to it. Wow, that is really high up. Wonder how we're gonna get that. Fun game, can you figure out how you can get that? Take that. I would love to be able to high jump up here. Thank you. Now I don't have to march all the way back to the Bramble Patch. And, ooh, the beehive is still here. Oh, but it's seen better days. Eat them, oh, come. Where are those final notes? That's what I really should be focusing on, because once I get all the notes... And the Jinjo. Notes and Jinjo. Those are the two things I really should focus on. Hi, bro! Oh, hey, notes! Whoa! I don't understand the physics behind that, but okay. Oh, that's an annoying thing, though. In winter, things make you slip, as you may have guessed. Eat them, oh, come. So I believe there's just one? Oh, hey, Namnet's house. Well, it's closed. But he also has a window, so... Let's see what he's doing in the winter. Hey, Nab Nut. Oh, he's sleeping. Mmm, acorns. This guy's got a problem. He, he literally eats, sleeps, and lives for acorns. Alright, Nab Nut, I hope you have some pleasant dreams. 
of acorns. Oh, oh there's a flight pad up here. Oh, that's exactly what I wanted to see, actually. Let's take out Robin Hood. Hey, Robin Hood, you're up high and now you're dead. Okay. So you see this window here? I didn't, probably didn't have to get that close to it, but I chose to get that close to it. Yeah. Alright. Break it open. Now we're gonna fly inside. Oh, here's Nabnut's acorn story. Wow, that's a lot of acorns. Oh, and here we go. Hollow honeycomb piece. Only one left. And it's kind of a doozy of a one to get. It's a, it's a little bit frightening to get. I'll be saving that for the last part of this world after I get everything else. So if I die, I can just try again really easily. I don't think there's anything else in this water storage over here, but I'm gonna try. <laughs> that almost knocked me off a cliff. I would be so ticked off if it knocked me off a coin. No, okay. Had to check, though. Oh, I missed the Blue Jinjo. Blue Jinjo is literally on top of Mumbo's skull. The rest of the notes are though. Are they down here? Yeah. Yeah, here's Blue Jinjo. Let's grab him so we don't have to get any of the Jinjos again. Ice physics! <laughs> Jeez. I'm trying to remember what those are. I know what one of them is. Wait. Oh, you can e even walk on the brambles in winter. I actually didn't know that. Where am I going? Why am I doing it? The flight pad's over here, you lack wit. Stop telling the same joke over and over again and thinking it's funny. You need new material. Hi. I don't like that. I'm gonna use the flight pad to take him out. Three men walked into a bar. Who think the third one was done? Ha 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 ha! That was unnecessarily risky. If I hadn't lined that up properly, I could have died. Don't do that. Do not do that, please. For your sake and mine, do not do what I just did. However, absolutely do do that. Very useful. Oh. <laughs> Gotta find those notes. Maybe I'm overall relying on the flight pad. I don't care. Okay, flying is safe. <laughs> oh no. I knew there was something on the roof in one of the seasons, and oh no. Alright, which one leaves me what? No, nope, they're both equally likely to fill me up. <laughs> You've only got a very small interval of time to talent trot, and if you don't, you might be dead. Alright, I have four notes left. Great. Those could literally be anywhere. Could even be in a different season, and I wouldn't even know it. Right, 
Maybe it's over here. Oh, hey, Eerie, I forgot about you. Thank goodness all the birds have, like, sealed themselves in the wood for the- Oh, there. Okay. There we go. Last four notes should be over there. As long as I don't die. Hey, Eerie, wow, you're big. Eerie, mighty eagle, at last! Watch me as I fly into the sky! Wow. Puberty hit him real well. <laughs> I have a word for Bear Friend! Here it comes! I hope that was in your talon. Oh. I actually don't remember where the last Jiggy is, by the way, so I'm hoping it's at the very top of the tree. Oh, oh no, I, do, I know where it is. I know where it is. I remember. Okay. Just. Oh, no! I hate ice physics. In every game, there are two games I like ice physics. One is the original Rayman, because they actually make it fun. The other is Ultimate Chicken Horse, because ice physics actually allow you to do things you couldn't do without it. Alright, good. Alright, I can die, and it's perfectly alright. I can literally die, and I will be completely fine with it. Because I only have two things left to get the final G and the Hollow Honeycomb piece. Okay, so there are two unaccounted for Mumbo tokens. One of them is behind Mumbo's skull in Bubble Boop Swamp. I don't know where the other one is. It could be, it, it could just be deeper in Grunty's Lair, though, because we haven't explored all of it. All right, so the final GG is at the very, 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 very top of the tree, which requires you to actually use the flight pad in order to reach. Here it is. Every jiggy on quick walk. So we're missing one jiggy, and that's the witch witch. Alright. Banzai! <laughs> oh, I'm already really tired of that. Alright. So the final hollow honeycomb piece. We have to go to Naughty's house again. But the pond's frozen over. However, as you may have seen earlier, there's one tiny little hole cut out of the river at the end here. However, there's um, there's a catch. Yes, that's right. Swim under there. Icy water takes double air. So much like the oil water from Rusty Bucket Bay, swimming in the ice water makes our air run out twice as fast. Brrr. So we gotta really, really hurry to Naughty's house. Also, there was a 1-up over as far away from this place as you can get. So if you want that, well, make sure you take a break in Naughty's house first. <laughs> Naughty, I hope you have a fire going. Oh, I hope you have a fire going. Whew. I don't usually get visitors in winter. Oh, he's got a hollow honeycomb piece for us. Thanks! And we get the final... Final G. Did that actually increase our health at all? It doesn't look like it did. I'll take the word for it that it did, though. Now we get to swim back. Because I actually... There's one other thing I want to do in this level. Actually, kind of two. I want to see if I can break Naughty's boulder open and spray, but I'll leave that for a bonus video, I think. I think there will be a bonus video just for me going back and getting the last two Mumbo tokens. I assume the last two Mumbo tokens, because it makes a lot of sense for me if there's 30 left over. 30's a nice round number. Alright. Yeah, I feel like autumn is a lot more dangerous than winter is for Click Clock Wood. Because winter you can just fly anywhere, and the only enemies really are those ice cubes, a few Robin Hoods, and then the evil snowman. Those pesky birds are gone. Anyhow, before we leave... Ow. That was not nice. Before we leave, let's go to spring. Because in order to get the witch switch jiggy, we need to turn into the bee and leave the lava. Ha <laughs> ha 
Somebody move this boulder! Naughty can't live in this house! <laughs> it, this is a new year, actually, and Naughty's just like, what the heck? Why did somebody move a boulder in front of my house every year? Not very nice. Don't care if I get hurt by the brambles. Hashtag thug life. Mumbo, turn me into a bee, please. Thanks. Clockwood. Whoa! Your best note score for this world is now 100! We have every note in the game. And once we get up here... We now have every Jiggy in the game as well. And that's gonna do it for this episode of Banjo-Kazooie. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. I'm Color Farney, and tune in next time. We'll be opening the final note door and seeing what lies beyond it. Hope you t t tune in then. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day and God bless.